much the world of e-commerce is virtual, much of it remains physical. Exporters looking to sell their goods online face challenges at every step of the way, before the border, at the border, and beyond the border. So global logistics firm DHL is looking to find solutions for small and medium-sized enterprises. Let's hear what DHL executive Stefano Arganese has to say. By definition, small and medium enterprises are, are handling small quantity of products on, on their own. The first challenge they face is how do we cooperate among SMEs in a certain countries in order to bundle um, their volumes and their purchasing power, organize themselves in cooperatives where they could bundle their volumes in a way that they don't need to ship two kilos every time, but rather shipping a pallet or a container of goods so that they can share the, the logistic cost. And obviously also at destination, if we say, for example, a trade from Africa to Europe, having in Europe a, a sort of small uh, warehouse or space where they can store that stuff so that when people order online uh, their goods, it can be shipped within 24 hours. Of course, the biggest logistic challenge in these developing countries is the challenges they face at the border. That being uh, complexity with customs, them being different offices that have to be dealt with in order to get all the documentation, all the stamps and to get the goods exported. From a government perspective, I think the most important thing that one should really put effort in is making this a trade facilitation agreement fact. That would facilitate everything which is related to border crossing activities, customs and the like. If we make that process smooth and quick enough, uh, the effect of that is that we basically get more trade and hence more revenue for the governments uh, as well. Another big challenge is the return of goods. So if a customer in Europe, for example, doesn't like a certain things that they bought or it doesn't fit size-wise or whatever, they want to return it, which is a common feature that every you know, e-commerce platform would offer in, uh, uh, in Europe, uh, you know, to handle that, to handle that return back to the origin country is a is very complicated challenge. So that's the way I would summarize. First of all is how to bundle purchasing power in order to have scale and deal with these challenges overall and then the classical issues that we have at the at the borders uh, in order how to overcome that in a proper timely and cost effective way and and then the third one is the return of potential goods that are not uh, to be delivered to the final customer